lot of things are hand-me-downs from my family, from Jean's family. Yeah, it feels like you guys inherited this from your favorite great aunt. Who, who was crazy. Who was crazy and, yeah, and like fabulous us. and full of style right. like you guys. Yeah. And then you plugged in your own stuff. I mean, you would never think that you started from scratch here with like a, a simple we rental We completely apartment. did. It was a rental project a, a, apartment, a white walls, plain basketball floor, kind of boring. Uh, and we did everything. The wallpaper, all the special painting. Look uh, at all that special. Talk to me about the special painting because, of course, my instant thing is, how do you do this? How can you inspire people that have a small apartment, like, this is not a big apartment. No, it's not. You'll, you'll, I'll walk you through and you'll see. There, there it's were, like full of life. There were a lot of strange beams here that you find in a pre-war 1930s apartment. And in order to kind of make them part of the architecture, we had the painter uh, paint little lines around it to outline everything. And it, it turned out great. It was a lot of trial and error. You made it dignified. Thank but you. not fussy. Thank you. It's so fun and free. Yes. I mean, look at the layer of the artwork. Uh, we we are definitely is... more as more people, and and the thing that I like to do is to hang pictures salon style, meaning you you, you focus on a big picture here, put group small things around it, kind of like. Is that the things. secret? Because a lot of people like want to know the secret. I, you make it sound easy. So it, is it putting a definitive piece in the center I, like your tiger? I, and I, then... I like to think so. In this room, we have the cool tiger painting, which we bought in Paris years ago at, at the gallery. Uh, um, it's this, the gift that keeps giving, right? Like gift, wherever yes, you put yes. it. You've seen this. This is the traveling tiger. It travels everywhere with us. So on this wall, we had a kind of niche that was existing, which I thought was perfect. We had our little banquette by Jean Sand fits right in, right in there, which of is perfect. Course. It was the lemonade fabric, which we adore, and cruel work. Where'd, that mirror looks like it could be as, at home in Miami. The mirror we or found in Morocco in, is the here. The mirror we found in Miami. It's a French a Rococo style mirror. We popped in lots of things around it. We love botanical specimens. But what's fun is we also mix the contemporary. This is right. Peter Schlesinger, this is um, Silverman, the table is by Ingrid Donat, uh, and, and it kind of all works. These tables here are by um, Fredrickson Stollard, we bought them in London. And I like how it's a continuing story. It's not a museum piece, and it makes it fresh because we've got lots of different contemporary art. It's like here we have the 17th, 16th century crucifix, which I bought at Christie's, I don't know why, but it was a cool thing, and mixed with the 1970s uh, resin lamp on the old hand-me-down uh, secretary from Jean's parents, and then filled with seashells, which I adore. Don't you think you have the largest collection of seashells well, we on Park them. Avenue? Hey, Frank, are these what I think they are, macaroons? All homemade. That's homemade? Mmm, yeah. it's so good. By the way, the chintz pattern it's so nice to see chintz again. Oh, thank you. Where did you... It, that's oh, a, thank you. Here. That, that's an interesting story. The chintz we bought as curtains in Paris, the flea market, years ago, and we cut them up and made them into slip covers for the fabric. The Get th out. Yeah, the chair. So they, right. you saw them as curtains? They were, they were called, for, curtains folded up from the 1940s. They were actual curtains. So we cut them up and, and made what, them into here. Them, like, no, they're great. Look at this. We did... Slip covers here and did a little skirt. They're super cute. So here's our uh, current dining room, which actually used to be a bedroom. We didn't need a bedroom, but we needed a formal dining room. Uh, Another small space solution, because a lot of people always want the extra bedroom. I love how you gave that away. We gave it away. There was a bed here. We don't need it, but we yeah, do need space. We it's need incredible. bookcase space, we, uh, and we need a So it's a, a library, dining. too. Completely. This was a completely empty room, which I designed and built all the bookcases with lighting. Um, and it's just... Oh, perfect. you obviously added, you built these completely, bookcases. Completely, completely. No, they look like they've been here for years. Thank you. No, it's a, it's a great, it's a great room for entertaining. I hated the chandelier we had that came with a rental. So we put in this old, um, uh, chandelier here, which is just candlelight. So really it's a room we only use at night, uh, except for me in the morning. I use it as a, as an office. Um, because you've got this great terrace right outside. I mean, great... this room is a little bit of everything. Thank you. Yeah, no, Indoor, it's, it's, outdoor living. It's perfect. But the, but, the sexy real, the, library. but the real surprise is this because it hides all of our paperwork and all my office uh -huh. things. And for Jean as well. So you can Look see here. That. It you has some trays in there. Exactly. All this stuff here. So we needed a really functional piece. Jean made that? No, he designed it and then we had it quilted. What is this wonderful moment on this <laughs> custom is, lampshade? This is, it's, I love it's this. Simple. This is something that uh, Jean did. We had a we had a boring lampshade. It was too bright for a, a dinner party. So Jean 
I took out these wonderful images of Matisse and Berard. And, these are some of my favorite and, Matisse yeah, paintings. Yeah, you know, some great ones. Which and you just fun. clipped them on? And we just clipped them on. It was a, a, a moment where we needed something quick. Um, Gene, you're so talented. <laughs> Don't think that we're not acknowledging you because this is a fabulous idea. It's great. Love your master bedroom. Thank so you. Much. Thank you. Oh, this is like a what you're wearing. Is it, this from yes. the same trip? Uh, different I trip, but I got this made for me in Marrakesh. Should we try it on? Try it, it, on. Yeah, it's so like, yummy and warm. It feels like heaven. you it's would heaven. want to wear it in October, yeah, yeah. No, which is great. like right now, or it, November first. It's great. I love this. Hope it fits. Oh, I like how you've decided to put your super modern huge TV screen on this fantastic... On my Python console. On your Python console. With our World of Interiors. <laughs> like, you are which totally we, like the man. Which we... You've got the World of Interiors yes. on your Python console. It's perfect. And hiding our Jack Pearson. And hiding your very uh, racy Jack Pearson in the most yes. perfect way. And you bring in all the past incarnations of your homes and your travels. I feel I like in every room that you're in. I do it with my clients as well. I, I think that a home should reflect the personality. And, and, and I, I think that our homes really reflect who we are, where they are, uh, and, and our journey going through the places we love, people we've met, artisans we've met and created things with. It's a, it's a wonderful, wonderful thing. It's so detailed in this apartment. It's so ironic that it's a rental because it's more detailed than <laughs> Don't many... tell my landlord, please. No, I know. We won't <laughs> tell your landlord. But I just want to say to you that I've seen homes that people have lived in for 30 years that don't even begin to get into the thoughtfulness that you guys have created here. Thank I'm so you. impressed. Thank you. No, it's, 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 it's not just what we do, it's who we are. And it's something that we really want to to show to our friends and our family, and, and, and this is the way we live. This is what we collect, this is what we respond to. And for me, as a, as a decorator, it's also a kind of laboratory. So in the rental, we had these kind of awful contemporary window frames, and we- Look what you did, look at yeah. the detail on that window treatment, get Thank out. You. Yeah, look at this view, so wait, what nice. is that? So these Where are- Where can I buy uh, that stack? These are uh, just uh, bamboo shades, and we applicate or sewn on sewed um, uh, antique saris and ribbons on there, just to make it more interesting. Wait, antique saris and ribbons? Yeah, you just... make that sound like just go to Bed Bath & Beyond and no, get no, the no, antique no, no, saris. Or... Beyond. Look we, how we... much thought you put into yes, it. Yes, so it just makes it more interesting. Oh, I didn't want to see this horrible window, but the view is spectacular. The view, the view is, is spectacular, no, 17th great. floor. It's great, you can see the um, East River there too. But you make it feel like a whole other world here Thank with you. your but customization of everything. That, that's, what, that's what we like to do.